what's up lads it's BT Gaming HD here with an informed field World Cup review with that 96 pace and as a striker I can't, I was looking forward to as soon as he got his hat trick I knew we were going to get an inform and I was looking forward to use this card so this is him I played him and it's just a basic BPL team with Lampard I did an inform review on him it should be up after this video or before it I'm not sure which order I am going to upload them in uh, but I have played around six, seven, eight games with this team and it is one of the best teams I've played with so these are his in-game stats, he obviously has the amazing pace, but he does have 82 ball control, 81 crossing, uh, 89 finishing, 85 dribbling and 81 short pass which are the standout ones and obviously the 85 shot power. But these are the ones that everyone wants to see, the physical attributes which is, no not these ones, the ones after these uh, with the speed and the acceleration and everything like that, they are much better than I thought they would be, there we go, 98 acceleration and 97 sprint speed that makes him one of the fastest players on this game if not the fastest and then the attacking position of 80 so we can get onto the goals now and he, as you can see he's going to be pacey as anything especially that striker player playing straight down the middle I played him with Moses and I think it was oh, I can't remember who it was on the other wing Oxlade Chamberlain sorry yeah um, but just a pace going forward you've got to do it this year with FIFA uh, but again one, <laughs> the players I've played with this year, the inform reviews I've done on them, every single one of them has been good. Apart from, um, not everyone, apart from a couple haven't, but the high end players have actually been good. This, The price of the player, I did expect him to be that exactly what he is. But again, look at that pace, there's no catching it, he's just going to go around the keeper. The keeper's got no chance. If you go around the keeper, you're going to finish it with improved shooting. But. Again, his positioning is just perfect from wherever he is because he's a striker now on this on this uh, on the game. So again, their uh, skill messing it up, but showing his strength and just getting straight past him and finishing into the back of the net. Just honestly, I can't believe how fast he's there. Running straight away from the defenders is not going to get that stop. Do the just do this fake shot, but I can't believe he's been put onto FIFA. But after this goal now, after the penalty, it is a goal by outside Chamberlain, but I just wanted to put it in this review. Walcott does set it up, which I hope you enjoy this goal. <laughs> thinking of whether or not to put that goal in or not but I thought if Walcott set him up then I've got an excuse of putting it in but yeah I did score that goal today it's my first one of doing it I've been trying for ages to do the um, where you uh, chip it over your head and do an overhead kick and that's the first time it's worked and luckily it was Walcott who set him up but again with a fake shot and just blowing him away with the pace but I think he's definitely worth it as because you're gonna put him as a striker um, that's one of the best things about informs when they get a position change because you've got something to actually buy the inform for that's the reason why his price will be probably higher if it was at the right wing and he didn't have any improved pace then he wouldn't uh, be going for as much as he is but I did buy him on the first day so that's why I paid so much he will be going down but next Tuesday will be the best time to get him but he's showing the pace rule in around one there's no catching him and he's good he's good at finishing as well which is a bonus because many fast players on this game can't finish for shit <laughs> but I'll get into the strengths and weaknesses at the end I think you should I think everyone will know what they are with the pace and everything like that as the game volume on my Sony Vegas goes loud so if you can't hear me that's the reason and again he does score a header but you won't expect him to score I'm um, sorry if you can't hear me but we'll go into the strengths and weaknesses now the strengths is his, obviously his pace his finishing and the reactions which was quite a surprise I didn't expect him to have so good reactions and I didn't find a weakness Generally, I've only played for 7 games, so there might be something that you know, but I did not find one weakness. But I hope you enjoyed this review, there will be more coming soon, there is a Lampard one being uploaded now, or it has been uploaded about half an hour ago. So if you enjoyed it, if you can, leave a like, uh, but most of all, thanks for watching.